Oh, hi dear Pisces, a very very good afternoon to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a general of reading for all the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the rules can be reversed anytime. Third thing, this is a reading from uh, today till the 10th of September. So let's start Pisces. Your partner's current feelings for you right now are, let's see. What's happening here? Three of Pentacles. Okay, somebody feels like putting in the effort and energy and teamwork in this connection with you and make things work out between you guys. Let me clarify the Three of Pentacles. Could be dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let me clarify the Three of Pentacles, honey. The High Priestess, the Two of Swords and the Seven of Swords. Oh my God. Nine of Cups. Okay. okay, this is not about the teamwork and the team efforts and anything about this. I feel this person is having some secret that they are hiding from you. Okay, and this is regarding a third party situation here. And they are on the crossroads whether to talk to you about this or not. It could be like they got to know something about you regarding a third party situation that you are dealing with somebody and they are very silent about the situation. And I feel this person wants to clear the air with you or it could be possible that they are having somebody else also in the equation. But they are on the crossroads and they are silent about the truth, about the secret that they have for you. Uh, that they are hiding from you that whether they should talk to you about this or not so it's kind of hiding game is going on secrets and uh, hidden things are going to come out and they are very very much confused about the situation what to do about the secrets what to do about the hidden things that they have they want to reveal something to you but again they are on the crossroads whether they should do it or not because they want to work things out with you again they want to work things out with you but there is something that they are hiding and they want to reveal. If they are doing it or not, I don't know. They feel like revealing it to you. But they are on the crossroads. Damn, they are on the crossroads. What to do? So, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius and Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see what you feel for this person, Pisces. Your feelings for them right now. Five of Swords. This person is giving you pain in the ass. It's, it's lots of stress, lots of mental games, lots of manipulation, lots of uh drama going on mental drama mental conflict going on between you guys right now this person is giving you a lot of stress honey let me clarify the five of swords the tower in reverse the queen of cups and the knight of horns something was okay something was about to fall something was about to break but again uh you feel love you feel care about this situation and you didn't took this action of you know uh, breaking things up with this person this is someone who is in and out of your life you care about this person you have lots of love and care about this person and this is someone who is in and out of your life and on and off in your life they are kind of a player energy and they give you a lot of stress they give you a lot of mental stress and trauma and uh, you just want this person to uh, you know give you not give you stress either to stay forever or just to leave but they are not doing anything so you feel lots of stress and lots of concern about the situation okay cancer pisces scorpio and uh, taurus aries leo sagittarius and gemini libra aquarius i'm not able to connect with the cards today but anyway i have to finish this reading honey let's see what this person wants from you few days are like this only some days you're not able to connect Queen of Pentacles, they want to, you know, you know, yeah, I, I feel they have options, but they are stuck on you. They want to make this connection work out anyhow. They want to make this thing stable and mature and practical with you. They want to sort things out with you. They want to make this connection stable, heal things with you. Let's clarify the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Empress, Eight of Swords and the Moon. Yeah. Yeah, see, they want growth and expansion with you and they want to, again, they have something hidden, something hidden is there. They are very, very stressed about something that they are hiding from you from a very long time or they got to know some kind of secret about you and that's giving them lots of stress and they want to, you know, uh, come out of this stressful situation and reveal the secret to you, get to know the truth about you or reveal the secret to you if they have that and they want growth and expansion. They want growth and expansion in this connection. They want to proceed further with you only okay they want to see the future with you but again there are certain things that are hidden certain things that are secretive certain things are 
uh, th that are creating lots of uh, overthinking and lots of confusion, lots of negative energy around this connection. Could be dealing with the Pisces, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see what you want from this person, Pisces. What do you want from this person right now? Knight of Swords, okay. Seven of Cups, you're confused. You want to take the, you want them to take a certain kind of fast action. To have certain kind of fast action towards something. You want them to rush about something. You know, you want them to rush. For some of you, it's, uh, this person is constantly running away from the truth or running away from the situation. You want them to stop and listen to you. Let me clarify the Knight of Swords. But you want them to take charge of some kind of situation. Let me clarify the Knight of Swords though. Lovers, devil, my god, four of wands, yes. Four of wands, swords in reverse and you want them to speak up. There's definitely a third party situation here. There's definitely lots of toxicity around the situation. There's definitely certain kind of marriage or certain kind of, you know, uh, engagement or stable relationship is at stake here. You want them to take charge of the situation and you want them to be very, very clear and honest about the situation regarding these two things. This third party situation, heavy third party situation is here. And a marriage and a stable connection is on, on stake right now. My God. And they are running away from the truth and you, you just want them to stop and talk to you and reveal everything about the situation. It could be you running away from the situation, running away from the truth. It's very, very difficult. The lovers, the devil, somebody is using some kind of negative things to keep you in with them there is a hell lot of negativity and toxicity around this situation oh my god i don't want to read it further capricorn gemini libra aquarius yeah gemini aries blue sagittarius let's see what's coming towards you till the 10th of september pisces Eight of cups, some, somebody's just walking away. Five of cups. It's painful to walk away, but somebody's just walking away from the situation. You, them, I don't know who's walking away from this situation. The one who is not very, the one who is not truthful, the one who is like uh, hiding things, the one who is having, you know, issues is walking away. Is not walking away actually, sorry. They, are, they will try to come back. The other person is trying to walk away from the situation. Now let, let's see how it is going to be. Nine of Pentacles, Six of Swords and Seven of Cups. Definitely somebody is walking away from this relationship and choosing to be single because this relationship is creating illusions, this relationship is creating confusion, mental conflicts, emotional trauma, lots of conflicts, lots of fights, lots of confusion, lots of drama, lots of emotional drama. And uh, this is not the first time this is happening and that's why the, somebody, some, you know, somebody is just uh, walking away. You or them, I don't know. But somebody is choosing to walk away from this connection right now because they feel like this is always a mess and this is always going to be a mess. Yes. Somebody is just uh, choosing to be single and move on towards another options because this is hell complicated. Very, very complicated. So thank you so much for tuning in, Pisces. And I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.